The overall goal of the following experiment is to get the three-dimensional structure of the exosome complex using the random conical tilt method. This is achieved by first depositing a thin layer of carbon film onto the holy carbon grid to make the support substrate for the protein complex and the stain. As a second step, the specimen and the stain are applied onto the grid, which buries the specimen into heavy metal salts. Electron microscopy is then carried out to get tilt pairs of micrographs of the specimen. Finally, results are obtained that show the three-dimensional structure of the exosome complex based on image analysis using the random conical tilt method. Generally, individuals new to this method will struggle because sometimes good preparation of specimen for random conical tilt method is difficult as well as the procedure for the image processing that follows. Viewer demonstration of this method is critical as the grid and the specimen preparation steps are difficult to learn without an illustration of sample assessment. The principle of the random conical tilt method requires taking a pair of micrographs of the same region of a specimen inside the electron microscope. One picture is taken of the specimen in an untilted position, and the other picture is taken of the specimen tilted at an angle between 50 and 70 degrees. Using the computer, the digitized micrograph pair is put side by side, and images from the same particles are selected. In this illustration, these images are marked by numbers. In three-dimensional coordinates, the images of untilted particles and their tilted partners are correlated to each other by the direction of the tilt axis and the tilt angle. The alignment of the untilted particle images brings the images of tilted particles to their corresponding azimuthal locations. Using multiple